Today I am trying the Hero Cosmetics Mighty Patch Micropoint Patches for Dark Spots. As someone with acne, dark spots, scarring, and pigment changes are honestly the most frustrating part for me. I can clear all of my acne but still be stuck with these spots on my face for months or even years to come. The Micropoint for Dark Spots claims to help with all of those issues. It says it's a powerful post-blemish patch that uses 173 dissolving micropoints to deliver an advanced combo of brightening ingredients. Luckily, a lot of my active breakouts have been clearing up, but because of the pigment changes, the dark spots, and the scarring, it still looks like they're here. This is the dark spot right here that I'm going to be focusing on. It's completely flat. There's no pimple or active acne there anymore. It's just a dark spot. It honestly looks more red, sort of, than dark to me. So the micro point patch is on. I don't feel any of the micro points. I actually expected to feel something like sort of prickly. I have the patch on and it's time for me to go to bed. So I will see you in the morning. Good night. Good morning. I'm awake. Barely. Just dropped it on the floor. <laughs> Ew, it has dog hair all over it. Right off the bat, I'm not really seeing a difference. It does say to use it again in two days, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm hoping that after our next go around, we'll see a little bit more of a difference. Good morning. It is the morning after trying this patch for the second time and I have high hopes. Unfortunately, even after the second try, I'm not personally seeing much of a difference, but I'm very interested to get the opinion of an expert. So I'm going to go over the footage with dermatologist Dr. Rita Linkner. It's really stressing that skin brightening end of the spectrum. So vitamin C, which is in the patch, is one of my favorite active ingredients um, to brighten the skin. It evens out your skin tone. Glycolic acid is in there as well, um, which is a fantastic, you know, hydroxy acid that not only controls oil production, but also can really help with hyperpigmentation and blemishing. Transexamic acid was the third call out ingredient. It's nice that you're seeing that active, you know, be grouped together with other brightening ingredients like vitamin C and glycolic. Do I think that using concentrated amounts of these active ingredients in a small patch could assist with improving discoloration, blemishing, and hyperpigmentation. Yes, and I think it's, it's, a, it's a great idea to treat things when they're in that acute phase, just when they happen. That's when it's your best chance to recalibrate and fix that. When problems become more severe, more chronic, they become more stubborn. And that's when you're not gonna see as much of an improvement with something as non-invasive as a sticker that you're putting on your skin. The thing to know with you and your skin tone and your complexion is you're rosy. What I see from a dermatologist standpoint are dilated blood vessels. So you're looking at red, the color red that you're trying to color correct. Nothing that's an active ingredient in this patch is gonna help you with that. What would happen in my skin type being of skin of color would more be on the end of the spectrum of blemishing. Something that vitamin C glycolic acid, as well as transexamic acid would do a better job of color correcting. When you look in the mirrors, if you see more dark browns on your blemishing after acne spots, if that's what you're struggling with, then using lightening and brightening ingredients, those should definitely help. I'm sitting on my bed, people watching as I'm shooting. And there's a lot of 